Hello everyone and welcome to my vlog. Today I am in Noumea at Côté Blanche and I am going to get a windsurfing foiling lesson from newly crowned foiling world champion Thomas Goyard. <laughs> He's a local and this is actually his local windsurfing club so I'm super excited and uh, yeah, I hope I, I'm not gonna break myself before the PWA starts but uh, I think I'm, I'm in really good hands so let's go meet him this is a foil board this is the club I found him so I think yeah we will have a bit, bit big sail but it's okay so the first rule is uh, to never let go your pole, like so when you fall, okay. hold your pole. I hold my pole. Otherwise, uh, if you fall, you can fall on the foil. You understand? We don't want that. The board will be like a normal board when you will uh, start uh, to go. The board will stick on, on the water and you will first take some speed without going up. Right? It's very easy. You just have to push on your back leg. Yeah. If you go like this, push a little bit. I think it's open the same. Really like uh, really the back end, otherwise you will capsize. The board will uh, will go up like not like this, it will go up like this and like on the side. And then you have to the board to push your front leg. Okay, so first back leg and then front leg. Exactly. Okay. You open you back, back leg. leg. Once you have it, you will be flying, and the goal is then to regulate your height yeah. uh, with the back leg, front leg, the heels, and the those. It's like it's like windsurfing. It's like windsurfing. It's like windsurfing. But, but the, I know how to do that. So you sh should be okay. <laughs> times uh, stopped breathing each time I took off <laughs> but uh, yeah really really super nice first experience thank you you're welcome, first of all. <laughs> you're welcome. Uh, I think I need another lesson now so what equipment was I using today Pro Kid formula I think something like Pro this. Kid formula the foil is a Ketos powerful one you can see the wing is quite quite large quite big and uh, with nice fuselage and uh, big stabilizer. What do you think is a good size board to start? Mm, this is good. 93 is, wide? Yeah, and yeah 90. Actually, you can start with anything because it's a lot about technique. Yeah. The first time, but then if you want to be uh, like comfortable with, with the back and not having pain, it's good to have wide boards. Okay. I have uh, one board for four in Numea. I have this board, which is a Fanatic 159 liters. Uh, which is quite big, but it's what we need for racing, so it's good. And I've got the Nell Pride foil. There's many settings, but it's secret, I, I can't tell you. <laughs> <laughs> so there's a new Caledonian foil championships this weekend. Yes. So I think you're both going to participate now. Yeah, of course. Yeah. So yeah, we wish you both good luck. <laughs> yes, yeah, maybe uh, Julien Cantel will be there. Ah, and, yeah. Uh, Antoine Albu coming or something. Ah, he's also participating. Julien, Antoine, Nicolas, myself, and actually I don't know. Benjamin. Benjamin Tillier. Maybe you? 
Me? <laughs> sure. Uh, yeah, I'm big competition. <laughs> yeah, but it's windy, you could. <laughs> no, no, you, you have to tomorrow to, to be ready. Okay, yeah. to, tomorrow I, I'm going to have another lesson. I just wanted to say that um, I had another foiling lesson and it was already a lot better. On my first lesson I was actually with a 7-8, so quite a big sail and the wind was really light so I needed to pump and I was only ever able to get up like 5-10 seconds at the time and then crash. Uh, I wish I had some better crashes on the camera to show you. There were some better crashes than the ones we were, uh, you saw. But uh, yeah, it was super fun and uh, my second lesson was already a lot better. Uh, I managed to stay up, I guess, maybe 30 seconds or something. So yeah, there is uh, some work to do till uh, we compete next year. So I hope you like this little um, episode of me uh, trying to foil and uh, if you have any questions you can post them below. I'm still in New Caledonia for two weeks so I can also ask Thomas to answer you. And in my next vlog I'm going to Pue, so uh, stay tuned, subscribe to my channel, <laughs> bye!